What's going on guys? Chase Daniel here, Chase Daniel Show. And today we are going to dig into Josh Dobbs. But first, thank you Launch Hydrate for sponsoring. Josh Dobbs, he was with the Arizona Cardinals seven days ago. Had a three touchdown game, got traded to Minnesota. He ended up backing up Jaron Hall. Jaron Hall got concussed and Dobbs went in and played about the most impressive game of a quarterback I have ever seen. He was on the sideline getting snaps with his center that he'd never taken reps with. He had never thrown to those receivers. He didn't take one snap in practice. Kevin O'Connell's in his ear the entire time telling him, hey, you have this concept on the left. You have this concept on the right. I don't think you quite get how difficult it is to do that, and especially on the road against Atlanta, who had the sixth-ranked defense. And then he brought him, brought their team back from a come-from-behind wind Man, Josh Dobbs, you deserve it all, man. I'll give you your flowers. Let's dive into it now. All right, guys, let's get right into it. Look, this is the 12th play of the game. Thought Jaron Hall played really well. It's unfortunate, you know, the rookie first start, had his opportunity, and then this play happened. Um, just, just unfortunate right here. Look, gets hit. It's not on the first hit, not on the second hit, but it's when his head hits the ground. Arms collapse. I'm not going to show it over and over, but I did want you to show this play that it's early in the game. It's play 12. Okay. Jaron Hall goes not there, there, and that's the one that happens. And then welcome to the game, Mr. Josh Dobbs. By the way, you're backed up. It's third and 12. You have no idea what's happening. You got a lot of motion, and <clears throat> you're going to end up taking a sack right here. And it's a safety, and, and I get it. Okay. And I just want you to know, like, you're on the road. You were with the Cardinals seven days ago, okay? This is the sixth-ranked defense in the National Football League. You got seven guys up. You were in none of the protection meetings with the center and offensive line. Everyone's looking at you. What do we do? How do we do it? And it took a while. Look, it wasn't all great for this guy. I'm going to be honest with you. It wasn't all great. He had two fumbles. He took this safety. But the dude played – one hell of a game and quite honestly might be the storyline of the year so far for what Josh Dobbs was able to do in this game. There was ups, there was downs in the end. He let a come from behind victory on the road versus the sixth ranked defense. Okay. Clayus Campbell love this guy. Okay. He like, like just defying the limits of age right here. And this is a good this is a good disguise. Look, they got seven up. Okay, they're gonna drop end up dropping four. And they're only rushing three. They get to them. I would have loved for 30 right here. Like help your quarterback out. Go make yourself available. And you know, look, this is probably not the best start, but it just makes the finish even sweeter. Okay. Hate to see this safety. Okay, but Clayus is pumped. They end up doing the dirty bird. It happens. All right. Let's go. Play 19. Motion, okay, thought this was good for the most part. Like the play design, okay. All it is is a little too tight end. You're gonna motion hawk over, okay, a through route, which means just clear it out of the way, and you're gonna have this dagger come open. Okay, this dagger is the one where he needs to go with the ball. This is exactly where it should go with the ball. But as you know, as you well know, Josh had no reps whatsoever with the starters. Okay, I'm going to pause it right here when the ball should go. Hitch, ball, look at this. Okay, through route, taking the safety out of the way. There's a big window for this little dagger route right here. You got the back and the flat. If anything, just throw to the back. Okay, can't hold on to the ball like this because eventually bad things happen. Look, this sack in the end zone for a safety on play 13. This is play 19. Six plays later, this happens. Not good. You can't imagine what's going through this guy's head right here. Man, I just got a sack for safety. I'm trying to make a play right here. Okay, I'm trying to throw it to my guy. Just like right there. And then just slips out. Like slips out of his hands. He gets hit perfectly right on the ball. You see the hand on the ball. So it doesn't even slip. He's trying to make a play right here. And fumble. Like not a worse start. Like the dude had some major mental toughness right here to be able to withstand six plays, really, really bad plays, and to continue to lead the team. 
Okay, they're in third and long. Okay, third and 11. What are we doing right here? There's a lot of people. Or where they end up dropping out? Okay, look, they end up dropping out. I love this play call right here. Pure progression play call. Okay, as far as a dart on third and 11. Love this corner route. Okay, Hawks on a five-yard in route. Okay, you're on a corner route, and you have a deep dagger, so it's a pure progression. You're reading one to two to three. Okay, and you love that this is covered two right here. This is exactly what it's for. And all Josh Dobbs is doing, I guarantee you Kevin O'Connell said in the headset, hey, you're just reading this corner. If this corner attaches to Hawk at all, you're going to throw this corner route. Exactly what he does. This is the first live rep he had with number three. And it's a dot for a first down. I thought the guys around him really stepped up. Really played well. Okay, once again, where are they coming from? They were an odd all game long, which is always difficult to ID. But Josh said, you know what? I'm just going to go back. I'm going to fire a shot. Like perfect throw, perfect catch. Like what he did. Guys, I'm going to say it multiple times. It is the, he did the unthinkable this game. To come in and actually be able to operate in a game like this. Like here it is, play 30. Cover zero. Okay. He don't know the audibles. He don't know the hots. You're just hoping they don't cover zero. And you're hoping that there's some type of short route for a cover zero beater. Which is really not because they had a double move on out here. Okay, he's sort of hanging out right there. And he, he's probably the hot throw. But it's clear as day. Cover zero. And Atlanta brought the pressure on him right here. And honestly... This guy, this nickel is scot-free, and he somehow spins out of it. I have no idea how. And this might be the run of the week right here. And I also want you to, like, boom! I'm going to show you this other view, but this 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 back is de a D-tackle. Wow! Like, amazing. The dude rallied his teammates, honestly. Like, this is sweet. Like, you know it's pressure. Like, you know it's pressure, and he's just like, man, I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm doing. All I know is this is my free guy, and he might not even know that. He sees it, pumps it, spins out of it, holds on to the ball, switches the ball, switches the ball again, and watch 31. This is a D-tackle. This, this, is, <laughs> this is wild. Yeah! <laughs> like, big old pancake. Look at everyone so happy on the sideline. He's like, yeah, it's a first down. It's a first down. These are the type of wins that can rally a team for the rest of the year. This is his first touchdown right here. All it is is a little slipper naked. Okay, you're going to come in and out. This back's in the flat. And I want you to watch. He's just going to go out here and turn around. Ends up throwing a touchdown right here. But I want you to watch Dobbs right here at the end of the play. Just how happy he is. Look at that. He, he knows. He knows it's a touchdown. He knows, hey, it's only uphill from here. Okay? We got the bad stuff out. He's pumped. He's jacked. It's better from this view. Anyway, okay, you got this down corner. Halfback in the flat. I love it. Get this guy on the move. Get this guy on the run. Guy got here Tuesday, and he's able to do this. You don't think KOC right here and this guy right here are happy? He said this was like the best win of his like entire career and what he'll always remember. Something special brewing in Minnesota, I think. Won three or four straight now. Really like it. Okay, this is just unfortunate right here. Look, he's in, he ends up he ends up reading the wrong side right here because he has no idea which plays what. It's a little in route from Hawk corner. Okay, it's the same thing. You want to read this for cover two. And it's a shallow cross and a dagger. So he might be able to read it one to two to three. He gets stuck over here too long. And this ball actually hits the back of this right tackle and pops up in the air. Like just really unfortunate right there. He's trying to throw it to the shallow cross and probably gets a completion right there because he throws it on his inside shoulder right here. But right place, right time for this D tackle. Made this D tackle's year. Right tackle and Josh Jobs can't believe it. Okay. 
So watch here. Actually, pretty good footwork. I like the left foot up. Okay, it's exactly what he did in Arizona. He had three touchdowns in Arizona six days ago, and he had three touchdowns freaking this game. It's wild. Okay, it's a good pass off. Right tackle just gets ran back, and I want you to watch this ball right here. It just barely hits right there as he's trying to throw, and he probably gets a completion, honestly, because this is a really good like, shallow cross route. This is like teaching tape. Okay, you want to stop, make him fly by. If he puts this on this inside peck, it might be a big play. Tackle just gets washed back. Okay, that's just unfortunate. Falls right to him. Okay, so continuing the adversity. It's like, man, I, can it get any worse? Can it really get any worse? Okay, play 40 right here. And this is when I thought that they started to really change. See him signaling all sorts of stuff. Kevin O'Connell's in his ear. Okay, he has still 15 seconds on the playcock to be in his ear. So he's able, he's able to say, hey, signal that to the left, signal that to the right. Talk to the O line about protection. It's just five man protection. Really let him get at the line of scrimmage so he has extra time to hear his coach talk. All right. Looks like they're in some sort of pressure right here. Okay, they see it. They're going out to it. Oh, the center. Center's going away from it, actually. Okay, so he's hot right there. Would have loved to see him re mic it. He doesn't. Doesn't matter for Josh, though. He's just going to get out there and scramble. That's what Kevin O'Connell said. Hey, look, like, if nothing's there, just run. Like, nothing nothing else is crazy. All they're running right here is four vert. And I like the way they do it. Four vertical. Okay, if they have this protected with a little key route right here, he's going one to two to three. But they don't end up, end up getting this protected. I'll show you from this view right here. Okay, there is nobody on this side at all. So why center, center, go this way. Protect your guy, you gotta help your guy out. They should definitely be going left. He's giving him a protection call. Look, they point to him. They point to him, hey, go here. He's like, no, go that way, go that way. No, we're going right. He should've went that way, he should've went left. Gotta help your guy out. But it happens. Get the edge like that. I didn't know this guy had wheels like this. It's just sweet. All right. First and 10. Let's see what we got here. A little motion over. A little fake the screen. Oh, I wish he would have thrown this because this is sweet. A little fake screen. Oh, give Hawk a chance right there, kid. Give Hawk a chance. He said, nope. I'm going to pump it. I'm going to get around. And I'm going to do it myself. This is wild. This big spike. Oh, I can't imagine what's going through his head right now. And it's exactly what it is. Just a little fake screen. Okay, here's your check down after it. Stutter and go. And gosh, don't really matter though. Because he just said, I'm going to take it myself. I love this pump fake. It gets them just enough. Quarterbacks do it all the time. Right here, slow his feet down. I had no idea Josh Dobbs was this fast. I had no idea that he's going to play a game like this. It's wild. It's crazy he got there Tuesday. But I like it. Stays in the pocket. Trusts his protection. Okay, the left tackle should be out. He gets out there eventually. This pump fake actually holds this guy right here. So Dobbs is probably thinking like, oh, man, I got no help. Okay, I don't know what my protection is. I got to take off. He actually has another touchdown to number nine right there. He said, nope, I'm going to pump fake it. Yeah, and get around you. 55, horrible tackling. Really good job, number four. Really good job, number two. And just takes it yourself. And look, he knows it right there. He knows it. Kevin O'Connell, man. Give him credit, too. Really, really cool. 21-19. Okay, let's see what they got here. Going for two. This is big. What we got? A dime of a two-point conversion. Like, and all they're trying to do right here, I think, is like end up running like this stock corner, this stock right here, and then an over route. So it's a heavy play fake. Get out on the edge. You got one to two. Number nine's open. He ends up throwing. This is a very difficult throw, in my opinion. And this is a very important throw of the game. Gets outside. Like, this is not open. And for him to be able to throw this as he's getting hit like that, to get in, that is a 
big time throw. The dude was feeling it, feeling it, man. Like, oh my gosh, this dude's insane. Look, look at this throw. He ain't open. In fact, he gets it right above his arm right there as he's getting smoked. Both feet off the ground. I love these coaches' reactions. All game. Yes. 21-21. Look at this. Pure emotion right here. Like, you knew something was special going on. That's cool, man. I love I love watching stuff like that. All right, 28-24, third and one. See what we got. Got to have it. Just come on. This is insane. Playing this Tampa 2 defense, they're running four verts. He said, I'm going to hole shot it. All it is, four verts, okay? Just throw off this safety. Hawk gets it. It's supposed to be a bender. He pumps this guy, steps up, throws underneath this corner. Once again, these cover two corners think they have anyone in the flat. There's no one in the flat. You should be hands-on sinking. And this safety is wide as all get out especially to the boundary. Like, look at that safety versus this safety. It just makes it a harder throw. I'm not saying he's working the wrong spot, but it just makes it that much more of a difficult throw. Steps up, slings it, and amazing catch. I'm going to show it from this view. Okay, steps up. Nice two-hand ball swipe right there. Okay, they were running past him all game long, trying to keep him in this pocket after what he did. Steps up. Okay, the safety's really wide. Look at this throw. Perfect throw when he needs it. An amazing catch right there. Gets both feet down. Oh, that's sweet. Catch. Yep, yep, it's a catch. Gotta love it. Okay, 28-24. It's fourth and seven. This is the ball game unless he gets it. Obviously. And what happens? They're rushing five. They're playing man, two-man coverage. Everyone's got a man. Okay. And that means no one is responsible for the quarterback. He's like Houdini out there. This is wild. I thought he was going to tackle right there. How in the world is he doing this? Dragging people. First down. Mic drop. That's so sweet. They're playing man. This is an interesting design for me when he has been killing you in the run game, but works out for Minnesota. Steps up. Thought this was a little bit of a hold right there by the left tackle. Okay, but it's not. Steps up, does his thing. Magic. We're on like a four or five out there. Decides not to go out of bounds. Gets pushed out of bounds. All right, and then this sets us up. Third and four, 27 seconds. Got to have it. This is a play that everyone talked about. We had, They had just installed this play the day before because they saw somebody else run it. All it is, inside release there, and this is exactly what you want versus cover two, call it red two coverage, okay? You want an, a corner, and then you want to put this nickel back in a lot of stress. And so what this receiver's taught, you're gonna go, you're gonna wrap around him so this nickel thinks you're wrapping. He's gonna turn his back and then you're gonna come slightly out and you're gonna settle. I'll re redo this. You're gonna settle in between this corner and this nickel. So this route is run perfectly. You just gotta have enough time for him to get over there, get behind the nickel, scare him a little bit. Hopefully this corner gets cleared out by this corner out. And I'm telling you, this cannot be a better throw or a better route. It's exactly what he does. Look at this nickel. He feels them. He gets out. We call it a little return route. And it's like they had practiced this 15 times before when in reality, they had never thrown it. And once again, Kevin O'Connell knew it when he had it. Like flying kick. Flying ninja kicks by, by guys. Oh my gosh. The amount of joy in this entire group thinking, hey, we're on our third quarterback. Our starter just tore his Achilles. Like this is perfect. It's so open. 
Just catch it. I love it. Josh Dobbs, you are my hero. Like, amazing game. Really can't get any better than this man. Story of the year so far, Josh Dobbs.